welcome to Quick Tech News, where we keep you updated in the world of tech without wasting your time. Today we're taking a look at a brand new folding smartphone, which is not the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 2 and it's not the Motorola Razr. What it actually is, is the Royale FlexPi 2. The name might seem familiar to you, as they were actually the first company to launch a folding smartphone. Their first attempt was a bit of a swing and a miss. It had this creaky hinge that made sounds when you opened it. An average at best display, and quite a few software issues that prevented it from being a smooth experience. But they are back again with the Royale FlexPi 2, and this time they mean business. And I don't just mean that sarcastically, they do seem to have made some genuine improvements. For example, the phone is now much thinner than previously, and actually seems to be thinner than the Galaxy Z Fold 2. The hinge mechanism seems to have had a significant upgrade, and no longer uses this accordion-like rubber material on the back. They claim that the hinge has no gap, but what I think they really mean is it has a pretty small gap. This time around they also have a rating for the hinge, apparently the design is good for 1.8 million bends, which is way more than anyone will ever achieve. The screen unfortunately seems to be lagging behind, it's a 1920 by 1440 resolution display which isn't terrible, but it's not cutting edge either. And since they did not market or speak about glass like Samsung did in their presentation, we can assume that the display is still using foldable plastic. The rest of the specifications seem to be up to scratch. You get the Snapdragon 865, 8 or 12 gigabytes of RAM, 256 or 512 gigabytes of storage, and a chunky 4550 milliamp hour battery. Continuing on, you get 5G support, a quad camera setup, dual SIM card slots, Wi Fi 6, and USB fast charging. That's a pretty decent list of specifications, but then for the price of 1500 US dollars, it better be. The area where I don't have much confidence in Royale is software. The original FlexPi phone was plagued with glitches and usability issues. This time around they're releasing the phone with Water OS 2.0, which they claim will intelligently split the screens across multiple apps. It should also let you drag and drop between them. Wear OS 2.0 is based on Android 10, but it's quite unlikely that you'll get updates for it in a timely manner. I would definitely be interested in checking it out, especially since I've yet to lay my hands on any folding phone, but for now at least that won't be possible since this phone is first launching in China. If you enjoyed this video I'd really appreciate if you liked the video, subscribe and tell your friends to help get this channel off the ground. Thanks and see you next time.